1965, Gordon Moore made a prediction. He said that the number of transistors on a chip will double every two years. Gordon Moore was born in San Francisco in January 1929. His prediction was called Moore's Law. This prediction describes a long-term trend in the history of computing hardware. The market has kept that pace for nearly 40 years. Since the invention of the integrated circuit in 1958, the number of transistors that can be placed inexpensively on an integrated circuit has increased exponentially, doubling approximately every two years. A transistor is a semiconductor device commonly used to amplify or switch electronic signals. They were invented at Bell Labs in 1947. It is fundamental in radio, telephone and computers. Some people say that it is one of the most important technological breakthroughs in human history. Nowadays, according to Moore's law, the computational power available at a particular price doubles every 18 months. It is a common belief that Moore's law makes predictions regarding all forms of technologies, but for the moment this is not true because it only concerns semiconductor devices. That is why other technologies have not developed so quickly. But other authors such as Bernard Binge, Bruce Sterling and Roy Cuthwell believe that the exponential improvement described by Moore's law will ultimately lead to a technological singularity. This will imply a long-term pattern of accelerating change that generalizes Moore's law to technologies predating the integrated circuit and which will continue to other technologies not yet invented. Many people think that sooner or later there will be a point where Moore's law will no longer apply because there is a limit to the size of the transistors. The principles of physics, as far as I can see, do not speak against the possibility of maneuvering things atom by atom. But with the invention of nanowire computing, the limits are not clear again. A nanowire has a diameter of 10, elevated to minus 9 meters. In the near future, nanowires could be used in extremely small circuits. According to Richard Feynman, Nobel Prize in Physics, nanotechnology will allow us making many high-quality products at a very low cost. Just what Moore's law predicted once again.